good morning student so on the demand of one student among you i am here with the solution of this question the question is based on euler maclaurin formula and the statement given is using euler maclaurin formula we have to evaluate this series the series is given to us right so first of all i want to make you revise what is euler maclaurin formula we have done this topic already so this is your euler maclaurin formula that is integration from x0 to x0 plus nh y dx is equal to h over 2 times y0 plus twice of y1 plus twice of y2 plus up to so on twice of yn minus 1 plus yn bracket closed minus h square over 12 bracket yn dash minus y0 dash plus h raised to power 4 over 720 bracket y n triple dash minus y not triple dash bracket close plus so on so this is your euler maclaurin formula so what you were given in your previous question that we have done uh, in this euler maclaurin formula this type of question was given that is a function y a function of x was given to you the lower and upper limit was given to you you just have to use this function apply these values and you have to calculate right to find out this integration but now in this case the question is given in this type the series is given to you so you have to identify first of all what your y is what your y here is the type is 1 over variable square right the variable is changing fine so what is our function y it is 1 over x square okay we are the starting value of this x is 51 that is x not as 51 and what is the difference between this value and the next value it is 2 right this not uh, look at the uh, square not look at the square only we are looking at this value right so difference between these two values is 2 that is 53 minus 51 so our h is 2 now how to find out how many values are there in this this is your first value that is initial value and this is your last value so this is your a that is 51 and this value is your b that is 99 right so i told you how to find out this n this n is b minus a over h so now here b is 99 a is 51 and h is 2 so it will come out to be 24 right so total number of terms in this series are 24 by this way we got to know okay now we have our n we have our x not we are having our x n that is x 24 the last term 99 h is 2 so each and every value is there so now we can put the values here in this formula and we can find out our value for the series the sum of the series right so uh, first of all we have the uh, we have this y equal to 1 over x square and in this formula we need the first order derivative of this function as well as a third order derivative because we are taking these three terms right so the first order derivative for this will be we can apply here power rule this uh, this function can be written in this way y is equal to x raised to power minus 2 right so what will be the derivative this minus 2 will come here and there will be x raised to power minus 2 minus 1 that is x raised to power minus 3 and we can write it in this way that is minus 2 over x cube right similarly Uh, what you have to find out the next third order derivative for that first of all you will find out its second order derivative then you will calculate your third order derivative it will come this minus twenty four over x raised to power five so now you have values for these derivatives y not is put x equal to x not in this that is x not is your fifty one right and this y n is put x equal to x n here and your x n is ninety nine. right so by putting these values we can find out the values for y n dash and y not dash similarly here what will be y n triple dash it is put here x equal to x n that is 99 and what will be y not triple dash in this put x equal to x not that is 51 and what is this h this h is 2 that is a difference between the values of this x right so by this way we got all the values so we will put them here in this formula so this formula will become now this y is 1 over x square dx and the values of x not is 51 and the last value the upper 
limit that is it is 99 so it will be go, uh, from 51 to 99 so it will be integration 51 to 99 1 over x square dx then come here we have to put here h over 2 h is 2 so it will be 2 over 2 then bracket start y naught the y naught will be put here y put here x equal to x naught you will get your y naught it will be 1 over x naught square that is 1 over 51 square plus then it is 2 time y1 so 2 time 1 over 53 square then it is 2 time y2 so it will be 2 time 1 over 55 square plus so on up to the last value the last value is yn there is no 2 multiplied here right so it will be only 1 over 99 square always remember this formula that there is not multiplication of 2 in the first and the last term right so by this way we have written this first term from here to here now come to the second term in the second term it is h square over 12 that is 2 square over 12 it will be so we have written 2 square over 12 then it is y and dash i told you about this uh, that is you have to put here x equal to x naught so it will be minus 2 over 99 cube so we have written it here similarly y naught dash will be minus 2 over 51 cube right and in the same way we will write this term okay so now we have put all the values in the formula now just we have to solve to find out the value of the sum of the series this one we have to find out this value now these terms are present here so this means we have to find out the value of this term right so first of all we will uh, solve this we will try to uh, solve it simplify it this 2 and 2 will be cancelled out so in the first term it will be like this only here it is 2 square it will become 4 it is 2 raised to power 4 it has become 16 all other things are as it is now this minus minus is plus so it will be minus 2 over 99 cube plus 2 over 51 cube so we can write the plus the positive term here and this negative term here similarly here this minus and this minus will become plus so plus of 24 over 51 cube then minus of 24 over 99 raised to power 5 sorry raised to power 5 okay so by this way we have just done this modification and this one all other things are same okay now in the next step what we have done we have taken this two outside and we have cancelled the terms then we have taken this 24 outside and we have cancelled out the terms so we got this okay so in the next step in the next step what we have done actually we need the value for this term not completely this term there should not be two here so let us take this term on one side and all other terms on the other side so what we will do we will shift these two terms on this side so this term a negative term will become positive and it will be transferred to the next uh, other side and this positive term will become negative so we will get uh, this series on one side equals to this integration uh, plus this has become positive and this has become negative plus other terms okay so uh, here now we are having in the left hand side 1 over 51 square plus 2 over 53 square up to 2 over 97 square plus 1 over 99 square now either there should be 2 on in 2 multiplied with every term so that we can take it out common there is not 2 with these two terms so what we will do we will add and subtract 1 over 51 square plus 1 over 99 square that is we have added one term 1 over 51 square and similarly we will subtract it so that there will be no change right so uh, also we will add and subtract 1 over 99 square we have added it here and subtracted it here so in general there is no change what we have done we have actually added this term and subtracted the same term so there is the answer is zero the result is zero there is no change the added this this uh, term with positive sign is added here so it has become 2 over 51 square and the term with negative sign is written here right similarly for this the term with positive sign is added and the term with negative sign is written here equal to 
this right hand side is as it is there is no change okay now uh, we can shift these these two terms these two values on this side because we don't need it here okay so when this will come this side it will become positive there it is and here we can take two outside now we can shift this two to this side so when i will shift this two here it will become one over two of this integration that is one over two of this integration sorry here one over two of this integration then with these two values here will be one over two multiplied yes it is here then this two when it will be shifted to this side it will uh, get divided by each and every term right so it is divided here it is divided here it is divided here and here fine so after that what we have to do we have to solve them to find out their values and here we have to integrate so the integration of 1 over x square it will be 1 over x how uh, we can write it x raised to power minus 2 dx so its integration will be x raised to power minus 2 plus 1 over minus 2 plus 1 okay so it is x raised to power minus 1 that can be written as 1 over x we have taken its modulus okay and the limit is from 551 to 99 okay so by this way solving them you will get the value for this using this euler maclaurin formula we have calculated the value for this series the sum of this series okay so this was the solution of this question using euler maclaurin formula if still you have any doubt in any step you can comment below this video i will try to clear all your doubts okay so thank you so much i am just giving you the view of this question again so that you can revise it using this video okay so please uh, do other questions also of this type and if there is any doubt you can ask me okay thank you so much students